A U.S. carrier strike group began operating in the South China Sea on Thursday, the Navy announced, amid heightened tensions with Beijing, which claims much of the body of water as its sovereign territory. Two Chinese ships are already tailing the U.S. group, a defense official told CNN, which consists of an aircraft carrier, a guided missile cruiser, and three guided missile destroyers. The Nimitz Carrier Strike Group, which has lethal and non-lethal capabilities from space to undersea, across every axis and every domain, according to its commander, entered the South China Sea for the first time as part of its current deployment. The deployment comes as the U.S. military bolsters its presence in the region in an effort to deter China, which is undergoing a rapid modernization and expansion of its own military and nuclear capabilities. This week, the U.S. and Japan announced a bolstered U.S. Marine presence in Okinawa, which would have advanced intelligence and anti-ship capabilities. The two allies also announced a series of other initiatives designed to bring the militaries closer together in the face of what they see as China's growing assertiveness in the region. We share a common vision with Japan to maintain a free and open Indo-Pacific and all the things that we're doing, you know, point towards that direction," said Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin on Wednesday, speaking with Secretary of State Antony Blinken and their Japanese counterparts in Washington.